Good morning, friends. Oh, hello. Let's get my favorite cup, my favorite mason jar cup thingy ever in the whole entire world. Right here. Yes. Le, oh my God. The best sauce ever. Do you guys know they sell them at Stato Brothers? Oh, I'm so mad. <gasps> Baby, we don't have any more of the other ones. Dang it, you guys. We only have medium roast left. I gotta go get more of the caramel macchiato. But this'll do. One-handed. Eh, it's not gonna work. Well, this'll do today. I usually like the caramel macchiato way more. Ugh. You like that? Favorite, no. <laughs> Favorite creamer ever. A little bit goes such a long way with this, you guys. Ooh, there you go. That's all we need. Oh, baby, can you help me? That still looks really dark. I like, like it. I like the little kick these days. Oh, Why nice. are you judging my coffee, man? I'm not, but you usually like, you like it um, with more creamer. Come on. Riley? Okay, fine. I have to go up first. I hope they don't believe me. Come on, guys. We're doing a science experiment. Okay, so. Oh, shit. I was dying. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> so there's a science experiment where the cook said. Riley! Riley! Riley, come here. They said if you give a dog an egg, they'll be really gentle with it and they won't hurt it. So we're gonna try it outside in case. So we're gonna do Riley first. Riley, sit, sit. Gentle, I know you wanna hear more. Gentle, okay, gentle. <laughs> Does he not want it? No. Oh man. No, they're <laughs> they're, they're just licking it. <laughs> yeah. Rocky tried to bite it, but. Oh wow. Yeah. I wanted to try the experiment. Here. That's Riley, not... come here. Sit. Sit, Bubba. Riley. No, he like tries to bite it, but then I think when he feels that it's kind of hard, he doesn't really care for it. They're not gonna bite it. Here. What? Ew. <laughs> I'll fail. Well, that was a fail. <laughs> I dropped the egg. Oh no, Guadi, you dropped my egg. Why would you do that? Whatever. That makes me really sad. Whatever, man. Don't judge me. <laughs> I'm not judging you. I would never judge you. I feel people judging me. People do judge you on your mayo obsession, but it's okay. Mayo is good, okay? If you guys eat, I know there's people out there. I know there there are people out there uh -huh. that eat sandwiches uh, with no mayo, and I just want to let them know. What do you want to say to everybody? That that's weird. People probably think you're weird that you eat like three I'm pounds kidding, of mayo. That's not weird, but to me, that's like I don't know, man. How, it, it's just I'm trying to I'm trying to think of something. It's like having. 
Jesus <sighs> Christ, that's a lot of mayo. What? It, like, I'm, I'm are you to, gonna put more on the other side? I'm trying to think of something. Are you gonna put more on the other side? I'm trying to think of something. Hold on, Gordy. Okay. It's Carlos like, can't think with his new haircut. It's like having a hot dog with no ketchup. You know what I mean? That's fine. I eat it plain. <sighs> See, something wrong. Something wrong with you. You know what bothers me? Can I express it? No. Okay. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I hate that you spread everything with a spoon. What do you want me to spread? I hate using a knife. With a butter knife. No. <sighs> Bothers I hate, me. I've always done it with a spoon and it works like... I don't know, man. That no. might be worth divorcing. Mm. Well, you not using ketchup on a hot dog, it might be worth divorcing. <laughs> exactly. Well, who got you premium meat, huh? I know. I went to Sprouts. I hate you. <laughs> Babe, you don't want to eat the ham? I got you ham too. Um, no. You just want this? Oh, Holy look, smokes, man. Look how freaking... Oh my god. I, you wanted I, it. No, I don't want it. You wanted no, it. No, ma'am. Well, it was one of you guys. No, ma'am. Dude, the pieces are ginormous. They are huge. Whoa. <clears throat> oh, wow. It's really good, huh? Yeah. It does not taste fake. I, I mean, I would hope that it's not. But you know what I'm saying. <laughs> You feel me? I would hope it's not fake. <laughs> okay, now I, um, I need a knife. <laughs> a knife? A knife. <laughs> this is uh, sandwich 101 with Carlos. I will say that avocado sandwich you make is really good. Carlos always uses the wrong knives, no cutting board. Sometimes he'll even cut stuff right on the really pretty plates that are very expensive. That's not true. Yeah, okay. I never do that. Yeah, okay. We literally got into a fight once over it, you guys. What? This avocado is uh, from Veronica. Just eat it, babe. And then what else do you add to it? Uh, the egg and honestly, I don't think I'm going to put cheese. No cheese? No, sometimes the cheese kind of throws the flavor off a little bit. It just depends on, no, I'll do a slice of cheese. Okay. Sometimes it throws it off. My mom gets... Sometimes, my, like when I would make sandwiches, my mom would be like, why don't you toast them? And it's like, because I don't like toasted sandwiches sometimes. That's what I say to you. Yeah, like sometimes I just want it like this. Oh, bread toasted is good though. And I kind of like it when it gets kind of soggy sometimes, you know? I don't like it because it gets stuck in your teeth. Yeah, that's the best part. <laughs> Literally. Mm-hmm. All right, and then your eggs? All right, oh, your cheese is next. How do you open this contraption? Thank you. Oh my goodness. Would you like one? No, thank you, baby. Sorry guys, Carlos is very shaky in the kitchen. It's not his favorite place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's how you make the sandwich. Carlos is genuinely obsessed with sandwiches. Yes, I love sandwiches. Sandwiches he are... He can eat it every day. I actually could. Yeah, he's gonna take the first bite for y'all. Oh, don't forget the chips. There's hot Cheetos. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Bon appetitis, you guys. Mm. What is that bite? <laughs> you liar. <laughs> mm. Everything? So mad. 
<laughs> You're mad. Hello, I am at Target. We are here because we need to get Carlos something to wear for tomorrow. I'm just looking for like a simple shirt, a simple blazer. And so wish me luck. I, we should have done this like yesterday, but there's bound to be something at Target. We're in the men's section and I'm very tempted to go into the Halloween, uh, not the Halloween, the Christmas section right now, but let's see if we get there. This is not bad. This is kind of cute. Um, I'm kind of going for like this look that this fella has right here. Very like casual cute. He needs to wear it tomorrow, but also needs to wear it on Saturday when we have Friendsgiving as well. So hopefully I find something here. They also have like dress pants here. So Carlos is at home with the dogs and he's really tired. He got up really early this morning. So I said I would go and get something for him. Let's see. Okay, we got options, you guys. We have a lot of options. It's hard shopping for Carlos sometimes because um, he's really tall. <laughs> so shirts, even if I get like if even if I get like an extra large for him, it'll land at like his belly button. So I'm always looking for shirts that are wide but also long, so it doesn't look weird on him. Hopefully we find something. I really like this, but I think he's just a model. I'm trying to like find that, but I can't find it. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at all of the Christmas stuff that are out. I'm literally in love. Look how cute these are. They have initials on them. Oh my gosh, this makes me so freaking happy. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. I think that's like a bigger version of what we have at home. Look at all the Christmas decor. I love this time of the year. It makes me so freaking happy, you guys. Wow, people start early here. <gasps> Look at these with the little polka dots. The little balls. Oh my gosh, how cute are these? I'm in love. They have like, oh, I got a bunch of these. Um, these are so cute. Look at them. Look how cute these are. I got a bunch of these for Friendsgiving. I'm thinking about putting it on like every single t uh, chair. That would be really cute. These are so cute, but they only have one left. I'm so sad. There's so much here. Oh my goodness. Look at all of this. See, this is like my type of style. I love these right here. This is really cute. Look at these mini bows. Oh my god, that velvet bow. Ornament packs, cards, cards galore. That's really cute. So fun fact, Carlos hates glitter and I love glitter during Christmas time. So we're definitely gonna butt heads. <laughs> I'm standing here waiting for six more to come. They're so cute. Oh my gosh, they're so beautiful, you guys. This girl's going in the back to get six more. Look at all this candy. I thought this one was cute, too. I love Ferrero Rocher. I thought this was really cute. So cute for like mini little gifts, and then they also have like a box. Oh, sorry. You said seven, right? Somehow we always end up here for the boys. Oh, they don't have any new Christmas toys. Maybe it's too early. Um, I feel like the boys have literally every toy here. Oh my goodness. <gasps> we have to get Casper this. Oh my goodness, look. Look, you guys. It probably squeaks, huh? Look at my cart. You guys, literally look at this cart right now. <gasps> oh my goodness, how crazy. What other toys? What other toys do we see here? You guys, how sweet. Our friends Jose and Gabby sent us a little card. It says just married on it. I love it. How beautiful. I love edible arrangements. I'm going to open this up and eat it. You guys, I went to Seize Candy for the very first time and met like the sweetest ladies ever. Um, if you guys are the Seize Candy, that is located on Han and Newport Road in Menifee. Oh my goodness. 
You guys have the sweetest people working there. Um, they are so sweet. They even wrapped it. I didn't know how fancy C's candy was. So I got a variety of things. Ah, it's so cute. Carlos and I can try it together since this week is very special for us. Do you guys low-key hate opening perfectly wrapped presents? It kills me. I was trying to open it all pretty. Okay, let's see. And then I also got this maple cashew brittle. If you guys go to Seeds Candy, please comment down below and let me know what is your favorite chocolate there because I'm very excited to try more. And they had like a collection of, oh my gosh, I don't even know, maybe oh. like almost 100. Which oh. one would you like to try? I got some strawberry for you too. Uh, I mean cherry, sorry. <gasps> That's the polar bear paw. Oh, this looks... It's white chocolate. I love almonds. white chocolate. Oh, really? Yeah, I'll wait for you. Okay, this one has strawberry in it. Ooh. And this is fudge. Ooh. And that's, okay, I'll try this with you. Okay. Ready? Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. 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 That is very good. Sweet and salty. Oh, I love brittle. Yeah, I brought this too. Mmm. I like walked past and I was like, I've never been inside. I'm just gonna go in. And they were so nice. So I was driving mm -hmm. towards Target. Okay. And um, I was I was at a red light with the lane next to me. Because uh -huh. you know how they're building that new shopping center, so like there's traffic. Yeah. So I was at a red light and I looked next to me and it's like a teal blue car. Okay. She makes eye contact with me and she takes like a double take. Okay. And I was like, okay, you know, it could be a subscriber, you, just, you know? Mm -hmm. And then the person that sat next to her, her friend or whatever, significant other, I don't know like took a peek over and like looked at me and I was like, oh, okay, so, you know, like, I'll, like I don't know what's going on, whatever. Mm -hmm. They either know me or they don't know me or whatever it may be. Okay. So that was in the weird part. Like, you know, sometimes subscribers do that all the time to us when we're like out and about because they don't want to say hi, they don't want to bother you, mm -hmm. I get it. So then um, we keep driving and I drive first and I basically, I get, I get stuck at a red light and I can see that her car is coming. Okay. And as she's coming, she's filming me. That's weird. Yeah, she's like literally straight up filming me. Like literally, I was at a red light and like her car came up and like she couldn't make it any more obvious. Um, she was like driving and she like held her phone like this. And then she got stopped at a red light and I was pulling up and she like moved her phone out so she can grab me like driving by. Mm -hmm. And it, it just made me feel really uncomfortable. So I like called Michelle because you were napping. I don't want to bother you, but um, it just made me feel really uncomfortable. Yeah, that's weird. So I was really uncomfortable the whole entire freaking time I was out. Yeah, like... So... I, like, I understand that some people... i rather her just scream out the window, hi. Yeah. But then it's like, you don't know if they're a follower or they they hate you and they're like a troll. I don't know, regardless, I just didn't like being filmed. It just made me feel uncomfortable. I just didn't like being filmed. I'd rather her like wave at me yeah, that, or that like try to out. get my attention. I would have rolled down my window and said hi and like talk to her during the red light situation. But yeah, that's, uh, it was just like really extreme to be recorded. Yeah, no, that's, that is weird. So yeah, I just felt really fucking uneasy the rest of the night. You want me to tent our yeah. windows more? No, not only that, and then I was like about to go home and I was like, I didn't want to get followed. Right. Um. Yeah, I didn't want to get followed home, but then I saw that she got on the freeway, so I was like, okay. Um, Because I was about to take the turn to get home, but I was like, no, I'm not going to do that. So then I kept going, Um, and I saw that she got on the freeway, so I was like, oh, okay. You, I just, you just never know. And I was thinking about like our safety and stuff. So, no, no, you just don't know if they're people are genuine. I get you. So yeah, that's what happened to me on the road today. Which like barely happens, you guys. Like, yeah, I love. It's not like, it's not yeah, okay. Like, let's clarify. It's not like I walk out the door and there's paparazzi. Like, no, that shit does not happen. Carlos and I are extremely normal people. We do normal things. Um, if you guys have met me in person, you know I'm extremely fucking normal. But um, it's the part where I was being filmed and it, that was just really uncomfortable. 
because I was just being a normal human being driving to Target and you guys can imagine how it would make you feel. So if you guys see me in person, please come up and say hi. I yeah, say it all just, the time. Just say hi. Carlos babe. and I love, love, love meeting um, subscribers and viewers and it, it literally makes our night. So if you guys ever see us, please come up and say hi. If you're 100% not bothering us, we will stop our dinner, we will stop our shopping. We will stop anything to say hi to you. And if we can't, then we will kindly ask you to wait so then we can say hi to you. Um, and for those followers who have met me in person, you guys know I will stop anything to talk to you. So, um, and if you're too shy to say hi, send me a message. I'll come looking for you. <laughs> or we'll talk over messages. But please don't just like nonchalant film me because that was really uncomfortable. It was just like an uneasy feeling. Okay, baby, I, I tried my best at Target. Look how good Carlos looks, you guys. He's <laughs> uncomfortable because I still have hair from my haircut. But you look like, so good. Look at that. Super itchy. Wow. Thanks. You look nice. Damn. Ah. Oh, that tag's probably uncomfortable. Ah. Ah. Have you guys ever had this? I think I'm going to eat it tonight with rice. It's my first time having it. Um, out of this can at least, this brand. It's sardines and tomato sauce. Let me know if you guys have had this. I have some extra rice left over from yesterday. So I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna heat this up with some white rice. The only thing I'm missing is cucumbers. I completely forgot to get some cucumbers today. But I think I have some lettuce. I always need some type of greens with my meals. as good as I think it is. Dang, they fit a lot in here. Fun fact, Carlos hates fish, <laughs> so he will not be eating this with me. Fish literally makes him, um, excuse my reach, uh, fish literally makes him nauseous. And I thought he was playing with me when we were first starting, like when we first met and we were like first starting to date. But I gave him a piece of fish once and homeboy could not handle it, handle it, so. Mmm. Wow. Not bad. Growing up, comment down below if you guys have had this before. Oh, why isn't it focusing? Come on, focus. You guys had this before? Comment down below, let me know. It's so good. This reminds me of like when I would come home after school and my mom wasn't home and there was rice in the rice cooker. I would just eat this with white rice and it's so good. It's basically like, I don't even know, like shredded dry pork. The consistency and the texture is really, really different. It looks like that. Can you put it on your white rice? Oh my gosh. Reminds me of my childhood. Sometimes when I'm bored, I'll just get a few pieces. Hello everyone, it's Thanksgiving day. I last minute have to go to get some ice because um, we have a good amount of people coming over today. Today we're celebrating Thanksgiving with Carlos's family. My family does not celebrate Thanksgiving um, unless someone plans it. Um, it's not a holiday that we like get together and, and have dinner or anything like that. I grew up that way so I don't know if a lot of you guys do the same where you don't really celebrate Thanksgiving um, but Carlos's family does so we always host Thanksgiving and Brooke always joins us because Brooke's family lives back in Pennsylvania 
Um, so she doesn't go home for Thanksgiving because she uh, saves up all of her time to go home for Christmas for like, I think like a whole week. So Brooke always comes and joins us uh, with Carlos's family for Thanksgiving. And then Michelle celebrates her Thanksgiving in the morning. They just have like, I think, breakfast or lunch together. And then at night, she comes and celebrates Thanksgiving with us. We don't do the traditional turkey or anything like that. No turkey, no stuffing. Um, we do whatever, whatever everyone likes. So today we have pozole. We have, um, what else do we have? I'm going to grab a rotisserie chicken. We have corn. We have mashed potatoes, salad, um, and uh, we also have spring rolls this time. My sister Kim uh, went to Brodard restaurant to pick up the spring rolls. Brooke is early, Michelle's on her way, so I'm gonna take Brooke with me to the store right now. But I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing, actually. It's so cute. Do you guys remember when I bought this from Target a few months ago? Hi, Brookie. Hi. <laughs> um, a few months ago, I bought this from Target. I'm wearing this today, so I'll show you guys in a little bit. But, yeah, we're going to go to the store to get ice. And I might grab, like, a few vegetarian things because Kim is vegetarian. I want to make sure she has, like, a lot of options because everyone else is eating meat. I'm so excited. I'm really hungry. We haven't ate anything. We're waiting. We're still waiting for my sister and my mom to get here. And her man. And her man. Ooh. We went to Stater Brothers and there was no... We went to Stater Brothers and there was no ice. All three containers were um, done. Everyone's having dinner, so. Surprisingly, there's a lot of people at the store. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, this is the time when they're, everyone's like preparing dinner, like, no? We forgot the chicken. Yeah, or like oh. we forgot this or we forgot that. You wanted to get a chicken? Yeah, but we have spring rolls from Bergard. Yeah. <laughs> well. So. Cowboys are losing, so that's good. That's all that matters, according to Carlos. Right now, that's all that matters. We're hungry. Who are they playing? Uh, the Raiders. I don't like either team, but I just I hate the Cowboys, so I'm really excited. They won last Sunday, so hopefully they win. No, it's not this season. So at the beginning of the season, I was just like, man, this season's gonna suck. But now that they've won a couple of games in a row, I'm just like, hey, you know what? It's not so that bad. So you're not a true fan because you didn't support them during I did support them, the I did support them because I watched every single game. You only support their success. Yeah, but you give up mid-game when they're losing. No, I don't. Yeah, okay. You guys, Do, he was there for the Super Bowl. And I've literally gone through seasons where... They only won the Super Bowl because we started dating. That's not true. <laughs> they, were, they were doing good the whole season. Whatever. You know, I will say, that's though, I point. will say, though, that once I dated you, Carson once got injured, so... I don't know. That's messed up. <laughs> That's messed up. Because that game we were... Actually, maybe it was because you decided to get sick that day, and that's why he got injured. It was. That the, So that <laughs> game... Sickness. That game that game that we were supposed to go see in L.A. is the game oh. that he got injured. And then what about the game front row tickets in Vegas that you did not want to go to? You didn't want to go either. Oh, God. <laughs> Look, I got you these. Ooh. Don't they look good? Those are so good. Yeah. You've had those before? Yeah. Chicken melts. Oh. They're so good. I can accidentally eat five. They look bomb. What the fuck? <laughs> accidentally eat five. They look so good. Look how thin they are. We ordered canes the other day. Yeah. And we got Chick-fil-A sauce. And we tried the chick the canes with the Chick-fil-A sauce. Was it like ten times better? It was way better. Um, so much now better. Now you're only gonna you eat You forgot your burger in here. Oh my god. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. Did you warm it up? Yeah, here. You never told me. <laughs> oh. Well, anyways, yeah, so if you guys, uh, where did you get that thing? Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich. She got the Chick-fil-A sauce yes. at Stater Brothers, no? Yes. Yeah, they sell the Chick-fil-A sauce in like a little squirt thingy, and... I never thought about things with Chick-fil-A sauce. It's really good. It's amazing, actually. What is it? How late are they open till? Today? Just in general. <laughs> Canes? I think mid. Right, oh, oh, one. No, they're closed today. Uh, oh. But they're like, usually open until one. Yeah, usually they're open. <laughs> usually they're open till two on the weekend. And then we got Kim what? We have we got Kim uh, vegetarian <laughs> buffalo wings and chicken nuggets. Nice. Um, and this is the best thing that's ever happened to me. If you guys are looking for a good present <laughs> for the holidays for someone, this is like.
I think you got it. <laughs> it was really hard. It's been in there since my birthday. Oh, is that the one? Yeah. What do you want to drink? Here. Uh, Where? No oh, it's trash. Oh, I have it. Thank you. No ice. Yes. 
it's so hard to get them all in a picture. Everybody! Before we slide out and let uh, Dirty, come here. Our Sorry. Why are we? Okay, ready? He said this is all the way. Are you ready? Are you ready? Oh, yeah, yeah. Go. That's right. Dude, it's literally not. Yeah. Wait, just keep saying. One, two, three. Dude, I don't, I don't think this is. I can't see it. Oh, this is. You have to hold her. Look, Cooper. It's so cool from Thanksgiving. Hi, Riley. Just gonna gently push you, okay? Riley, mommy just wants one photo. I see, I see, I see. Ready? One. Just click it, Michelle. Wait, hold on. Oh my God. Just do it. <laughs> wow! Oh my god, that's so beautiful! Oh, wow. Wait, hold on! Yeah. Hey, Cass. Sit. Riley, sit. Sit. I got your girl. Sit. You're so heavy, I can't. Oh, good oh, boy! Ow, oh, you're heavy. Okay. Casper! Casper, come here. I can't lift him. He's so heavy. Que para acá. Oh my god! <laughs> sit. Riley, sit. Okay. 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 Riley, sit. Oh, did you get it? Sit, Riley. Casper, Casper. Right. Riley, sit. sit down. Sit down. Rocky, go back. Rocky, go back. Sit down. Rocky. Riley, okay. Sit down, Rocky. I don't want kisses anymore. Sit down, right? There he goes. Oh, oh, there you go. Lay down. Okay. Okay, there we go. Cool. Okay. Move, move, move. Quick. Uh. Rocky. Okay. Sit down. Okay. Sit down. 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 Sit yeah. Thank you. That was hard, man. Yeah. Okay. okay, look at Casper. He's so regal. Oh, <laughs> look at Casper. He's sitting. He's ready for the next Okay, we're going to go. Yeah, I'm going to with you. Okay. Okay. Um, I want to get a photo of just them all sitting. Okay. You think it's impossible? I think we should try it. Yeah, you think it's impossible? Yeah, I think it's impossible. Hey, leave your brother alone. Casper, come here. Just you guys, right? Yeah. At least we're trying. Rocky. Ready? One, two. Cooper, come here. Rocky, you know what? Let's see. Rocky. Rocky. Okay. Come here. Put your hand in your pocket. Yeah. Yeah, put it in your pocket, friend. Why are you crying? No. Because you never know what to do. I see. Good? Yeah. Yeah, ready? Riley. 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 One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Friend! Yeah, yeah Smile! <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Look at it. Look, Cooper's just behind me. Wait, Cooper was behind us. Oh, cool! <laughs> 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 Welcome back to present day vlog. I'm so excited for vlogmas this year. You guys, we have this whole house to decorate, but this is what we're doing in tomorrow's vlog for vlogmas day two. Let me give you a little bit of a sneak peek. We have all of this decor. We have this beautiful tree. I'm so excited and Today is Vlogmas day one, so we are starting this and I'm very, very excited. We're gonna sit down and uh, talk to you. Look at this beautiful advent calendar that I got months ago. Look at it, you guys. I literally saw this months ago and I was like, oh, I have to have it. This is from, I bought this from Magnolia. Um, Fixer Upper, um, what is it? Chip, Joanna. Joanna and Chip, their mm -hmm. brand. Um, their website, I'll try to link it down below for you guys. I'll have to find it first, but it is so cute. You pull out all the little boxes and like there's stuff inside. So let's sit down and talk about this. Oh man, are you so freaking excited? Oh man, said he's excited. Okay, so, ah! 
I'm so excited. I just want you guys to like look at how beautiful the detailing is. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hi. He said he's here. Everyone's here. Alrighty. Right right here too. Everyone's here. You guys, come on. Vlogmas Day 1 Advent Calendar. I know, I know. Okay, so the rules are every single day will be a different Vlogmas day and every single vlog we are going to open a box from the advent calendar. So obviously today is Vlogmas day one. So we're going to open the box right here. This is number one. And every single day there's going to be an exciting giveaway tucked inside the box for you guys. So in order to enter the giveaway, you have to be subscribed to this channel. You have to like this video and leave a comment down below with your Instagram. Instagram username because that's how I'm gonna message you and get your information for the prizes if you do not have an Instagram just go ahead and make one it's super easy it's free you just need an email um, super easy to navigate and then every single day after 24 hours I will pin the winner in the comments so make sure you guys come back tomorrow to check the comments to see if your comment was pinned or if it is pinned you should have already gotten a notification and I will also reach out to you on Instagram as well. So those are the rules. I'll have it in the description and on the screen for you guys. But today is day one. So I wanted Carlos to open this one, which I'm really excited. Oh, thank you. Hmm. Um, Casper bought me avocado toast. Oh, did you want it? But this was brothers. Did you ask brothers? Oh, do you want it too? Oh, Riley, that's so mean. Okay, fine, you can have it. But sit. Sit, please. Sit. <laughs> okay, babe. Vlogmas day one. What's the giveaway prize? I looked earlier. <gasps> I'm just kidding. Oh my god. Oh, so Carlos and I. I, don't, I. She knows what the first one is. I don't know. Yeah, I already know what the first prize is. Yeah. So we're aware of the 25 prizes we have in the box, but we mix them all up, so we don't know. <laughs> Which day is which? We, we, the only one we know is the last one because the last one we wanted to make yes. really good. So that's the, literally the only one we know. All the, the last ones one. Are mixed up. Yeah, like towards the end, it, we kind of have an idea because they're pretty good. But look at old man, always want to be cute. Okay, okay, baby, go. Vlogmas day one prize is. You guys want to win the prize? Make sure you enter. Leave a comment, subscribe, and like. Ooh. Don't forget your Instagram username. Ooh, why is it so small? The prize is. Oh wow, it's two hundred dollars. Oh wow! I don't know if you guys can see, but it's two hundred dollars. I'm acting all shocked, like I didn't write it. <laughs> two hundred dollars is today's yeah. prize. Ooh, Look at that, yeah. you guys! Two hundred dollars is today's prize. Ooh. Successful for Vlogmas Day One. Make sure you guys come back tomorrow to check the comments down below to see if you guys won. If you want to enter, subscribe, like this video, leave a comment down below, and then also uh, add in your Instagram username. I will reach out to the winner after 24 hours. Can I enter? And, no you can't. <laughs> and I will pin the winning comment. So we're gonna do one entry per person um, to make it fair for everybody. Yay, that's today's prize. We will see you guys back here tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 2 for the yeah. second prize. And tomorrow we are decorating this this beautiful tree, and we're decorating our home. Yes. So if you guys are into decorating vlogs, we um, already started. I don't know if you guys can see. <laughs> we, oh, have, oh, no. we have some new stock. Ah, oh. right there. Right there. <laughs> and we got some new things around the house that we want to show you. Mm -hmm. um, so we're really excited. We love you. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye, Koopy. Oh,